Hello, my name is Bob Watson. I'm with Annalee Dolls. We're here with the Gift and Home channel talking about how to gain confidence selling on the retail floor. Specifically, right now, we're going to talk about practicing what we preach. And this is really important because a lot of times in the retail area, what I see is a, um, uh, I see employees who aren't comfortable walking up and talking to customers. And the excuse that they always use is, I don't have anything to say. You know, when they practice what they're going to say, they don't have that excuse because they're going to walk up and they're going to know. So the first thing I always have anybody practice is uh, actually the greeting. It's the first, it's the most important, and it's pretty standard. So they're going to say it a lot and they're going to say it over and over again. I suggest people go home to practice this one. Stand in front of a mirror and say it three times. When you say your greeting three times, they're going to work out the language. They're going to make it their own and they're going to start to feel it. After they do it three times, I say do it three more times. This is the memorization area. This is what's going to actually drive it home and put it into their system so that the next day when they show up at your store or when you show up at your store, you can walk in and start talking to customers. You know, you don't want to make the customer the practice ground. They're there to have a nice experience and if you're up uh, stumbling around, not sure what you're going to quite say to them, they're going to they're going to know it, and it's going to make them not want to be there. So again, practice the greeting at home, bring it to the store. The next thing that you want to do is actually go home and practice one value tip, something that makes your store special. Practice that one again three times in front of the mirror, working out the language, three times to drive it home and remember it. Bring it to the store the next day and use it. When you get down into the product tips, I suggest you always practice one. The first week you should definitely practice one. Practice in front of the display, looking at the product, just like you were there with your customer. You know, this is the Annalee Dolls. Again, I'm with Annalee Dolls. Always talk about Annalee Dolls, but it works well with any product. It's practice telling them, geez, do you know that uh, the Santa Claus themes change every year? So pick it up. Pretend that the customer is there. Pretend that you're showing the customer that this is what the Annalise Santa Claus looks like and you know next year that Mrs. Claus is going to change themes. So if you want the pair, you got to buy them this year. Put the product back down. Do that three times and the next time you see a customer in front of the display, walk over and give it a try with a good interception. Saying it to the customer is really important and saying it in a comfortable fashion because that's what makes them want to buy the product and ultimately increase sales in your store. Again, my name is Bob Watson with Annalee Dolls. Thank you for joining us here at the Gift and Home channel. We hope to see you again soon.